Hello and welcome to day, I just uploaded day five, which means I'm editing day six, which means today is day seven. Welcome to day seven. I'll get there. I'll figure it out. It's Sunday. It has been a very slow Sunday. I still need to make coffee and stuff. For the moment, I have all my windows open, which is really nice. Um, it's currently about 66 degrees outside. Um, it got nice and cool last night. It got down to, I think 47 was the low. So I did sleep with some windows cracked open. So it got down to 60 seven in my apartment. I was just buried under a pile of blankets and it was just so warm and snuggly and cozy and just made me so happy. So even though it's still warming up a little bit during the day and I have to kind of close the windows, turn the AC on for, it's only like for a few hours, like five hours tops. The temperatures have at least come to a point where it's like upper 70s as a high and so by sunset, it's already like back down to mid 70s, and then as soon as the sun goes down, it's into the 60s. Today, I really need to set my planner up for December. So I'm gonna start with that, because I set it up, so last week, which was the first week of December, December started on Wednesday, so there were two days of November. So I printed this planner spread out and this is what it looked like. I did decorate this one for Christmas because it was mostly Christmas, mostly December, mostly Christmas time last week. So I printed out the pages, but I didn't set up the December spread. So December is very blank. I did start filling out my task list for December, but I haven't color coded it yet. I haven't done my December tracker. And then I have more weekly spreads. So I want to just decorate all the weekly spreads for the rest of the month. And the only reason why this one is already partially decorated and has washi tape on it the same way that these pages do is because when I printed these pages out, I accidentally hole punched the wrong side. So I put some washi tape to cover up those hole punches. So I don't know that I will do washi tape all the time, but I do have, this is my pack of washi tapes that I got. So we've got the Woodland Critters, Candy Canes, Presents, gin and Gingerbread. Men. Then I've got some markers I can use um, that go with some of the colors in here. I've got my Little Book of Seasons sticker book from Target that I didn't finish up so I still got a few stickers on that sheet and a few stickers on that sheet so I'm going to use those and then I've got this page from a newer set of stickers so I'm going to start off using these on the monthly page and then I've got there's not very many left I have rationed this book out I think I got this I got this October of 2017. I got this the first time I met Tamsin in London. So I have rationed this book out significantly. So you can see there's only a few stickers left in here. Um, that's also when I got this pack as well. So yeah, I'm just gonna put on some Christmas music. Or actually, I might open up my laptop and put on a vlog, see what's been uploaded for Vlogmas so far today by other people. I was a little late uploading my Vlogmas today because I overslept by an hour. I meant to wake up at nine, which is when I'm trying to upload these. I ended up waking up at 10. I was like, oh shoot. Um, so, <laughs> oops. So yeah, I'm just gonna kind of take about 30 minutes. I am I need to eat breakfast, but I'm not super hungry just yet. So I think I'm gonna take some time to do some planning. I just wanna get this set up so that starting tomorrow, planner's all ready, I can just get to work because tomorrow it is back to work time, even though it's now working at home and working mostly on book stuff, I do still need to work tomorrow. So today's gonna be mostly a rest day. So I thought we'd do like a plan with me. I'll show you whatever little bits I do, but it's probably not gonna be much. <laughs>
Okay, I think it's all set. So I've just been watching Life with MJB and she's been doing her December plan with me. She's been keeping me company. So I now have December kind of set up. Um, I've, I really only have three weeks left of like work time because I really want to take the week after Christmas and before New Year's off. No work at all between them and then I'll start getting back to work like on January 3rd is when I'll get back to work and like working more on book stuff and prepping for the final prep for the spring semester. So I've crammed a lot in <laughs> to three months down to upload question mark. I'm really hoping I can get the book uploaded by like the 22nd, 23rd. That is kind of set up there. I've broken up my December task list. So these are the things I really have to get done over winter break. And then these are the things that I would like to get done. And as you can see, they're mostly marketing tasks. So I color code my task list. Blue is like marketing and book admin stuff. Green is teaching related and pink is like book production related. So copy editing, formatting, the cover sketches, proofreading, all of that sort of stuff. I haven't decided if I'm tracking anything in December. So this is just blank for now. This is the week we're currently in. This will be next week. So I've gone with like a peppermint theme and I'm putting mostly task lists and then four lines for appointments or timed things like calls and stuff. Then I've gone with a little theme like this. So I have these really cute like Christmas truck stickers, Christmas tree truck stickers. So I've got little Christmas trees as well. And then this is Christmas week. I've given myself full days to work on the 20, 20th and 21st, kind of a half day worth of tasks on the 22nd. I've still put some tasks on the 23rd and 24th because I'll still be like uploading vlogmas and stuff like that. But you can see the week gets lighter throughout the week and then nothing on Saturday and Sunday because I don't work weekends in general and the weekend is the holiday. And then for the week in between Christmas and New Year's, um, I've just um, gone with like a black and gold theme. I had some and like slightly pink. I had some Happy New Year sticker. I kind of combined a few sticker packs here, but just kind of created a really chilled out space. And I haven't put any task lists here because I'm just going to kind of fill this in as I need it. I probably won't fill it out as like a task list, but just jot down general things I want to do. But this is the week I intend to take completely off. I will be done vlogging. There will be some videos that go up this week, like um, the what I gave for Christmas, which will be pre-filmed, what I got for Christmas, which I'll probably film like on the 26th or 27th. And then my one second every day will probably go up on Monday the 3rd. So this week I'm gonna kind of just take off and just read and sleep and watch movies and relax and do absolutely nothing. <laughs> I think that's it for the planning. I hope you've enjoyed this little bit of a plan with me. I can now go get some coffee and get some breakfast and I will finish watching um, Life with M MJB's video while I am making coffee and stuff. I'll take the laptop into the kitchen with me. I did a ton of dishes yesterday, so I've got a ton to put away, but the one side of my counter is now the cleanest that it has been in ages. So there is space. And I'm just seeing a comment come in on today's Vlogmas from Lily saying, who is the one who recommended that I get the Too Faced palette. So she's saying, yay, I'm glad you got the palette. Thank you, Lily. Uh, it was a, it was definitely a good recommendation. I'm loving it so far. I can't wait to play with it more tomorrow and throughout the week. I am gonna go get some coffee and some breakfast and get back to enjoying a cozy, snuggly day. We'll see what the rest of the day does. Probably do yoga again today. That just sounds really good but I might go walk and check my mail at some point just to get out of the apartment a little bit. So we'll see.
Hello. Okay, it is only three o'clock, so not super late in the afternoon. I have edited, edited the vlog. It should be exported, so I need to start uploading it. And I just got done taking a bunch of pictures um, for Instagram. I wanted to get some new book pictures. I'm still going to be taking some more. Um, but I wanted to do some flat lays today. But yeah, I'm gonna get back to relaxing. I'm watching a vlog right now. I'm watching a girl named, I think her name's Katie, and her channel is Living the Life You Love. It's all about like slow living, mindful living, which I'm getting into, but she's doing Vlogmas, so I'm watching her episode of Vlogmas. Enough talking, because I talked enough earlier today with the plan with me. And I'm still gonna talk to you guys again later. So time to rehang these ornaments, put those back, get snuggled back in my chair, and get back to watching Vlogmas. I might make some hot chocolate. Let's make some hot chocolate. <laughs> Alrighty, it is now the end of the day. I have finally <laughs> put up my Christmas lights on my balcony and they are making me so happy. Now that the evenings are getting nice and I'm sitting with my balcony door open instead of closing my blinds, I'll actually be able to see the lights on my balcony. It's a little bit after six. I've had, I've done yoga, that was lovely. I went and took my trash out, checked the mail. There was no mail, but it was still a nice walk. It was feeling really nice out there. Yeah, then I put up the Christmas lights. So I'm gonna, I'm not super hungry yet, so I think I'm gonna wait another like 20-ish minutes and then I'll have dinner. Find something to watch on TV whether it's Vlogmas or another film or a mix of both. I also found some um, Christmas baubles out in the storage closet that I forgot about. They were supposed to come in with everything else, but they were kind of off to the side. So um, I've added some of them up there. So they look very nice. Those are the ones that have like a pattern on them. So they look really good up there with the garland and the little poinsettia clips. And then I've got others that are just, those are like a matte red. I've got four that are a shiny red and I've added those to the garland over the fireplace because it just felt like the neutrals were just not quite doing it for me. I wanted even the shinier neutrals, like the rose gold, I wanted some like pops of red. So I'll show you those when I sit back down, but I think, 
I think I like it. Well, I'll live with it for a couple days. If I don't, if it doesn't really work, I'll move them over to here, but um, I'm glad to have those in. So I think I'm now completely done decorating for Christmas. <laughs> but yeah, it's feeling really cozy and magical and festive in here, and that just makes me happy. So I hope you've enjoyed this vlog, this day of planning and resting and just kind of getting set up for the week. Um, if you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not subscribed, all of that good stuff. And our question for the vlog, pull a question out of the jar and answer these in the comments below. <laughs> okay, so movie, this is going to be a bit of a stretch. I think another question eventually is going to be your favorite like actual Christmas film, but this question is movie you have to watch in December that isn't actually a Christmas film. As I'm thinking about how there's a lot of people, and this came up in the film I watched last night, the debate over whether Die Hard is a Christmas film or not. I know a lot of people who that, that is a hill they will die on. And so I think there are some films that while not technically a Christmas film, you do just, I do just have to watch them in December. So for me, a film, I feel like Little Women is one of those. It's not technically a Christmas film. I always have to watch it at Christmas time. The other film, or more like series of films, I don't think Harry Potter is technically a Christmas film either, but it has at least a couple scenes set at Christmas. All the films came out in like October, November-ish, like around the beginning of the holiday season. And I don't know, there's just something about it every year for the last has it been for the full six years I've been doing Vlogmas? I'd have to go back to the first Vlogmas to see if I was watching Harry Potter in them. But for the last few years especially, I do a Harry Potter marathon where every December I sit down and I watch the films one a night. But yeah, I think Harry Potter is my film that like is not a Christmas film. They're not Christmas films, but I have to watch them at Christmas time. So let me know what film do you have to watch in December that isn't actually a Christmas or holiday film. I would love to know. Say hi in the comments. Let me know how you're doing and yeah I will see you all in tomorrow's day of vlogmas thank you very much for watching this one bye